Item number one is a resolution recognizing Memphian and Motown funk brother Jack Ashford for his contribution to the music industry and his recent Hollywood Walk of Fame honor. Councilman Collins, you have the floor. Yes, ma'am. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Is Mr. Ashford present? <laughs> Mr. Chairman, it gives me great pleasure an honor for the Memphis City Council to recognize one of its own citizens <laughs> that make extra, extraordinary contributions to not only our city, but to their industry careers as well. Whereas the city of Memphis has a rich musical heritage that is known throughout the world as evidenced by the thousands of tourists that descend upon Bill Street to hear our many talented artists. Whereas Jack Ashford is one of Memphis' own who has left an indelible mark on the music industry as a member of Motown's Funk Brothers. And whereas Paul Justman's 2002 documentary, Standing in the Shadows of Motown, stated the Funk Brothers have played on more number one hits than the Beatles, Elvis Presley, the Rolling Stones, and the Beach Boys combined. And whereas Jack Ashford played percussion, the tambourine, biofrom, and the marimba with the Funk Brothers who backed most of Motown's recordings from 1959 until the company moved to Los Angeles in 1972. Whereas Jack's tambourine was one of the dominant forces that gave Motown Records its distinguishable sound that we all remember from the hits like My Girl, Ain't No Mountain High Enough, and Baby Love. And whereas Jack is a two-time Grammy Award winner, Lifetime Achievement Award winner, and holds several gold records recipient, and was most recently acknowledged in Los Angeles with a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. And whereas it was key donations by Motown stars Valerie Simpson, the late band leader Paul Schaefer, and Ray Parker Jr. that made possible for the star at Hollywood and Vine after the initial nomination in 2008 by Stu Miller, who was instrumental in the Funk Brothers receiving their lifetime achievement. And whereas his wife Cher is indeed proud of his accomplishments and contributions to a musical legacy known throughout the world that indeed changed R&B music for the better. And whereas the Memphis City Council deem it appropriate to recognize such an outstanding individual and citizen. Now therefore be it resolved by the Memphis City Council that Jack Ashford be applauded for his exceptional contributions to the music industry in helping to create music that transcends generations. Be it further resolved that the Memphis City Council congratulates Jack Ashford on receiving a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame and the musical heritage he leaves for young artists to build upon. Adopted this June 18th day, 2013, signed Harold Collins, a member of the Memphis City Council. Mr. Chairman, I so move. I need a second. Okay. I got the second verbally by Ms. Halbert. Can we record that, Madam Comptroller? That's having moved by Collins, seconded by Halbert. Uh, all those in favor, please sit the Papa saying aye. Aye. Show that unanimous congratulations. Ms. Lynn Zittler and Ms. Johnny Walker representing the Film Commission and the Memphis Music Commission here present to be with us.
and also thank the uh, city council as well as the citizens for this wonderful honor. I have to condense 50 years into five minutes, so I got to talk fast. I uh, I've been here since 1983, but I have been involved with Memphis, Tennessee for a long time because I used to moonlight from Motown to cut records with stacks. So the Johnny Taylor records, Carl Palmer's, I played on all those records. And I always wanted to bring something to Memphis to add to the great legacy that already existed. So just recently, I did some recordings here with Elton John, Bob Skag, Ray Parker Jr., and a host of European artists that came to get my services. And uh, I'm going to show you what that star looks like. There's only a couple thousand of them existing on the planet. So this is about as close as you're going to get to it. <laughs> show my appreciation for your being so considerate, I'm going to give something to you that exists nowhere else on the planet in a city council, a duplicate of this for your citizens. Tennessee, and uh, Alex Coleman said to say hello. He made a lot of this possible. I have to give him some credit What's for that. Up? What's up? And I'm just overwhelmed with all of these proclamations that I have. I think i got to get a bigger house. So I'm going to... Same thing for Dylan and doing everything. 